Hey everyone, CJ here. Just gonna give you a little rundown on what I gotta do to my car this winter if I get to it. Uh, as you can see, I took away the pallet that was holding the front end up and replaced it with some nice Camry wheels, Primewell tires, Craftsman jack stands. I think they're Craftsman. I don't even know anymore. Um, if you don't remember, it's a 77 Trans Am. As you can kind of see it. it. Looks like one, right? Just the front end's missing because it's over there. And over there and over here. But anyway, um, what I'm gonna try to get done is finish up the trimming and welding of the floor pans that were put in by the previous owner of the vehicle. As you can see, there's a, a bit of trimming and a bit of welding I need to do. There's still some pinholes I can see light through, especially on the driver's side. There's a, quite a bit of metal that's still hanging around. It doesn't need to be there. But anyway, um, the rear floor pans of a crawl underneath here, as you can see, are pretty well done. I don't need much to do with those, or need to do much with those. Uh, nice little zip tie there. Um, just need to clean them up and uh, coat them with something because they're starting to get some surface rust. But as you can see, California car, so the uh, underside is pretty clean. A lot of factory undercoating still. And uh, if we move around to the driver's side, you can see what else. Ooh, finger in the way. You can see what else I need to do. I need to uh, fix this nice little crack here in the uh, in the jam. Too many uh, openings and closings of that heavy ass door. Also, if I come down here to the dog leg, there is a hole which I need to uh, put a patch panel in. Um, sorry, has been a patch panel put in. You can see it's. Uh, just kind of spliced in there. There's also a hole. I don't know if you'll see it though. There's also a hole on the inside under here with this damn big ass tire that I put on here is in the way. My GTA rims. Ooh. Oh, but that's it. I'm going to try and get that done this winter. But you can see the insides of the floor pans look pretty nice. My camera's uh, not focusing very well. But anyway. There's the driver's side, it looks like crap, but it needs to be cleaned up. Same thing with the passenger side. It's nice and echoey in here. Yeah, well, so that's all done. So just gotta clean up, clean up some extra metal, finish some welds, and then I can put the uh, front end back on it, get it rolling once again, and maybe a year, two years, three years, four years from now, I'll uh, find a drivetrain for it. So that's it. Thanks for watching. And maybe I'll post another video someday when I do some more work on the car, other than just lifting it up more safely. Bye.